status to Amanda Bynes' latest run-in with the mm. law. She seriously had another one? Mm. Uh, oh, the rumor mill overfloweth right now here to separate fact from fiction. It's rumor has it. Please welcome founder of GossipCop.com, Michael Lewitis. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> Daily Beast contributor, Paula Froelich. <laughs> Uh, Michael, I guess we got to start here. Uh, J-Lo, Casper Smart, and there's like some photo, I'm told, that is, um, well, here it is. Uh, what, are, what am I looking at here? What should I be looking at? The ATM or that other store? <laughs> well, from his perspective, the ATM. You know, definitely he was photographed at the wrong place at the wrong time. He what maintains. Is what is that? That's a peep show. That w yeah, yeah. That's yes. It's a fun factory. What? And, it's a fun uh, factory. He maintains that he ran in there to go to the ATM, got his money. <laughs> um, which, which, by the way, is super sweet. But those of us who live in New York. Those buildings are the kind where you hold your nose, clutch your purse, and run past. Yeah. You don't say, oh my god, there's an ATM, as opposed to using that one over there. As opposed yeah. to using, yeah, going to, the, going to every other yeah. of the million ATMs it, in Manhattan. Five per, per, per block. Okay, so it doesn't look good, but that doesn't mean, we, what do we know about this? Let's not jump to any conclusions. <laughs> well, <laughs> I'm trying, It's way Casper. too late, actually, I'm jump trying. Through. You know what, We're, we know that he's upset he got photographed outside that building. <laughs> That's what the lawyers are upset and they're threatening the star and other places like that saying that it's false and defamatory saying that he was caught cheating right. they say he was not caught cheating and they're threatening a lawsuit now okay that's cool uh, I mean, that makes sense mm -hmm. but really I mean because um, let me tell you it, it probably cost you like four dollars to use that ATM I'm saying there, there are a lot of free ATMs in Manhattan um, there are reports that they're breaking up and then we see pictures of them mm -hmm. with the kids looking really really happy what do you know about that well this is what happened so of course the pictures of him in front of this peep show they say their problems in the relationship they're breaking up but the fact of the matter is despite that photo they're perfectly fine and they were photographed over the weekend looking happy you know what? I'm just going to add a little thing in mm -hmm. here um, I'm actually a little bit more skeptical than Michael do you think that's PR I, I I'm skeptical because if we all remember Benifer and Ben Affleck, remember, they're like, we're fine, we're going to the Ivy, we're still in love, and the next day, wham. Yeah. You know, she likes to do this. I do also kind of feel like she likes the manly men, as in she, the guys she stays with are usually the ones with power and are kind of manly. This guy is just kind of like a Chris Judd redux. Okay, oh. <laughs> what could possibly be wrong? I uh, want to move along quickly here. Other celeb news, Amanda Bynes found herself in some more car trouble. She mm. really just needed to hire a driver. Uh, tried to get comment from her on this, uh, as we all remember again, arrested on suspicion of a DUI just a few months ago. Oh, Amanda, you've seen better days. Pleading not guilty in court. Michael, though, uh, tell us what happened this Saturday. Okay, so this Saturday, she rear-ended another car, and she got out of the car this time. The last time, she rear-ended a cop and drove off. Oh, that's a problem. This yeah. time, she You're learned her lesson, and she got out, and she said, well, you know, I see your bumper's a little messed up, and the person said, well, your car's really pretty messed up. Let's exchange insurance. She said, nah, it's just very minor, and drove off again. Huh. Really? <laughs> so, Criminal charges here? Well, you know, they did file a hit-and-run report, is this the biggest uh, crime? You know, she's got other stuff to worry about. Yeah, the sad thing, thing, though, is yeah, people are only remembering these hits now, not the ones that she had on screen right. years ago. Well, I mean, at the end of the day, this is just another stop in, like, the train wreck express. You know, it's like... Do you, th do you think we're headed for trouble here? Or are you guys hearing at the Daily Beast that there are, are problems? You're kind of heading for Lindsay Lohan, Bill. Oh, no, I at hate some, to hear that. You know, at good. some point, you're just like, you know what? I, you got you to gotta stop. Yeah. You know what's going to be really good? Melissa Etheridge. Yes. Yeah. Yeah.